Seems like we're killing, killing innocent people. God damn it! What's the problem now? I'm getting weird temperature readings. I think the animus is overheating. Christ! It's always something. How long? Too soon to tell. These delays are unacceptable, Miss Stillman. I want progress reports every hour. It's gonna be a while, Desmond. Why don't you go lie down or something? Get some rest. Alright, so... I'm guessing that red means it overheated or something. Alright, uh, yep, I'm guessing I have to go to sleep again. What the hell? Someone's been in here. Right there. Looks like some kind of access code. Ah. Has anyone taken a shower? No. Oh, God, oh, 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 what the hell? There we go. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm gonna go to sleep now. And here we go. Rise and shine. We've got quite a day ahead of us. You're in a good mood this morning. Miss Stillman has made some modifications to the Animus. You should be able to remain inside even longer now. And help you with your treasure hunt. This is serious business, Mr. Miles. I don't think you fully appreciate the work that Abstergo does. Maybe because I don't actually know what you people do. We change the world. Every day, in a hundred different ways. Did you know that nearly every single breakthrough of the past millennia, be it medical, mechanical, or philosophical, has come from Abstergo or its predecessors? That's a bold claim, Doc. Think you might be exaggerating a bit? Not in the slightest. Oh, we certainly don't take the credit. That would arouse far too much suspicion. We choose our beneficiaries with great care. Why? Isn't it obvious? It means we're in control. But how? What makes you guys so special, so smart? That you happen to invent all these things while us mere mortals stumble around like idiots? To be fair, we don't invent them. We find them. Find them? They're gifts, Mr. Miles. From those who came before. We'll have to continue this discussion later. Time's wasting. Okay, well, now we have to go back in the Animus. There's a book here. I can't read it. Morning, Desmond. Yeah. Hi. It don't even seem like it's daytime and nighttime. It's, it's day sunny outside. Well, it's just, you know, it's just daytime. I don't think it's nighttime. Well, in this game, anyway. But what's this? Uh, continue. Wait, what's this? Ready to uh, up, Desmond? Whoop! <laughs> We're on memory block four now. I can't even pronounce that name, <laughs> so I'm not even going to try. But yeah, let's just go into here. Been exposed to the guards. Yeah, it kinda do Break seem like we're killing side. innocent people. And try to hide from them. People that aren't Take even doing anything wrong. Anonymous again. Come in. I mean I know they're Templars, but yeah. You've done well. Three of the nine lay dead, and for this you have my thanks. But do not think to rest upon your laurels. Your work has just begun. I am yours to command, Master. King Richard, emboldened by his victory at Arca, prepares to move south towards Jerusalem. Salah Hadin is surely aware of this, and so he gathers his men before the broken citadel of Arsuf. Would you have me kill them both then? End their war before it begins in earnest? No. To do so would scatter their forces and subject the realm to the bloodlust of 10,000 aimless warriors. 
It will be many days before they meet, and while they march, they do not fight. You must concern yourself with a more immediate threat. The men who pretend to govern in their absence. Give me names and I'll give you blood. So I will. Abun Nukud, the wealthiest man in Damas. Majduddin, regent of Jerusalem. William of Montferrat, liege lord of Akka. What are their crimes? Greed. Arrogance. The slaughter of innocents. Walk amongst the people of their cities. You learn the secrets of their sins. Do not doubt that these men are obstacles to the peace we seek. Then they will die. Another of your items is restored. Take it. See that it is put to good use. Return to me as each man falls, that we might better understand their intentions. And Altair, take care. Your recent work has likely attracted the attention of the city guard. They'll be more suspicious than they've been in the past. Alright. Again, the new abilities, and yeah, I did catch. Oh, catch ledges. And grab break. Okay. But, um, yeah, for that one, I'll probably just skip. Oh, no. Not this again. Yeah, I'll probably just it seems my skip when I travel. What it is to wield the blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. Oh my goodness, your students should be understand by now. Alright, here we go. Bam. Grab you. Whoa, yeah. Do that. Bam. We done. Alright, come on. Come on. Grab me. Grab. Come on. There you go. Uh, there we go. I'm done. Dang, alright, I'm busy. You will die here. Yeah. And tutorial weapons. No. There we go. I understand. I am busy. Alright, now we gotta kill like three more people. I knew he hit something. Where is he going? I think it might give me like three more places to go, but um, yeah, I guess eh, I'm probably gonna just start skipping the whole travel because nothing really happens when I travel to the uh, city, so I'm about to just start skipping that. If I had it just jumped off there, I would have been pissed. this horse come on come on come on there we go yeah it's not hard to get there it just you know takes up a lot of time traveling well seeing me travel anyway so yeah I'm probably gonna end up just skipping that so yeah I'll Talk to you guys when we get to the area. Alright, so I found out that <laughs> the three people we gotta assassinate, or the three people, are like they're back in the same cities I already been to. So, yeah. I thought I had like to travel to another city. Like I said, it's been so long since I beat this game, so I don't really remember much. Were they training or something? I mean, it must be. Okay. <laughs> 